Hello and welcome to Sav Exclusive. I'm your host Natasha. And with me today is this amazing performer, artist, songwriter, a man of many talents. He actually also wants to be an actor with time. Um, if you want to get to hear all of this gist and more, stay tuned, don't go anywhere and we'll be right back. Welcome back. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> so with us here is Jugo Asa. One and only. <laughs> I love your name, by the way. Thank you. I think it is so unique and quite different. Yeah, it's intentional. Yeah. I know, right? But, 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 but why Jugo Aces, though? Well, I mean, Jugo stems from my, my name. Like, okay. My name is Jephthah Ugochuko. So that's where Jugo comes from. Okay. And then Aces is like, I mean, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> well, basically, I just, I just like to excel in everything I try to do. So the top is where I want to be. Jugo Aces with the attitude. You know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so your backstory. First of all, okay. you are also, I mean, you are Jeff to Lawrence. Yes. And... Um, you have, you, you did the generic, you know, studying back in the university, something totally different from what you're doing now, <laughs> yeah. you know, but absolutely you are great at what you were doing as an artist, Thank but you. what's your backstory? Well, so, um, the, the usual for so many, so many Nigerian youths, <laughs> I mean, I, I grew up in a, in a family where, you know, science was like the thing, right? So. I was a science student. <laughs> yeah, I studied microbiology. I ended up studying microbiology. But, I mean, you know, when music calls you sometimes, you, you have to leave everything else. Like, no matter how, you know, how much you want to do something else, it just keeps calling you. And that's my story. Music has always been calling me. Like, I've always been in that music space at, since forever, from the choir. I mean, like, even from when I was a kid, you know, it's always been there, but I just never chased it, like, as a profession, yeah, yeah, up until 2015 when I released my first single. But before that, I've been doing the whole choir, the whole backup singer, the whole every almost shit, every that. artist seems to have a backstory, you know, with yeah, the choir. Yeah. And I wonder why they eventually get to leave the choir, but that's a story for yeah. another day. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but honestly, so yeah. your genre of music is so unique because there's actually like an ongoing conversation yeah. about R&B genre being dead, hmm. you know, yeah. the target audience, you know, crippling with time. And, yeah. you know, there are not a lot of R&B artists out there, especially even here in Nigeria. So yeah. why that genre of music? Well, the truth is, in reality, there are actually a lot of R&B artists, right? But a lot of them have just morphed into doing other genres. Other genres, <coughs> yeah. yeah. You know, because a lot of people are very focused on the market, right? I mean, nobody wants to Sales, sell. Sales, money, exactly. money. Everybody wants to get the chain real quick, right? But, I mean, I grew up listening to R&B music. You know, I grew up listening to a whole lot of, like, Mary J. Blige, all the Whitney Houston's, all the John Legends, and all of those people, are, you know? All of those people. So that, like, really rubbed off on me. And I felt like, man, this is what I should be doing. Like, I like my music to have that penetration in your soul, something like that. Yeah. So R&B makes that a lot easier. <laughs> Absolutely. Now, I know that, I mean, Africa, right? Mm. African parents already have a bias toward, mm. tell me <laughs> toward about, the creators, right? <laughs> so you come up and you tell your parent, I want to be an artist or I want to go into music. They're already looking at you like, you're not serious with your yeah. life. <laughs> you know, so did you have any of that drama, you know, trying to morph into music uh, on a professional level? Well, thankfully, like... I never have really had that, like, so I never even really had that conversation of, okay, dad, mom, I want to do music, All right? So they had always seen me, like, doing solos in church and singing in the choir and all of that. So they already, like, knew that somehow, somehow, they, maybe they never thought professionally, but they knew that this talent is there, you know? But then I had to just, like, oh, more, I have to do this music thing. If not, I would not feel fulfilled. Like, for me, that fulfillment was everything. But I'm thankful my parents supported me. My mom is like my biggest fan, so she like she always tells me, I can't wait to see you on TV. <laughs> like, I can't wait to see you, like because she 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 always encourages me to keep you know making great music, and so I never really had that. 
Okay. Yeah. So, but but you 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 are also an independent artist. You're not yet oh, yeah. signed to any record label, <laughs> yeah. and I know it can it can be pretty tough mm, for tough. Ryan, <laughs> you know. Absolutely. Because because you know we we get we get we get. Um, most times deceived by all that we see. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's glam. He's just, you know, producing music. Mm -hmm. We don't know the backstories to it. So how has it been as an independent artist? It's been tough. The truth is, it's been tough, right? You know, um, as an artist, there's a whole lot that goes into you becoming that artist that everybody know and love, right? There's a whole lot of rehearsals. There is a whole lot of failures. You know, there's a whole lot of things, you know, money spent that you never get back. Some are wasted, <laughs> you know, some scams, <laughs> you know, you fall into different kind of things. Like, you know, you have to promote your music. You have to make sure that, you know, you're people, literally everything. You're, 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 you exactly. Want. You're literally everything. So it's been really, really tough. But I feel like the more I do it, the easier it keeps getting. Like you're, you're getting more experience. You're learning a thing or two, you know. So, I'm, I'm, I mean, it's what I love to do. So the passion drives me and I'm not complaining. If yeah. the label comes along, great. If not, I keep doing my thing. And that's something you're looking forward to, you know, having um, getting signed to to a record label. Well, that's something you're looking it, forward to. I mean, to. yes, it, that would be great, right? But I'm not like I'm not desperately looking for one. Like I'm good, right? I mean, what a label would do for me is to amplify, like really amplify what I do, right? But I wanna I wanna just keep making my great music, and if I have like a lot of support from my my fans and people who love me. Regardless of a label, people would love me if they love me, right? So that's my major focus. So well, one of the music that, you, you know, one of your songs that you're actually putting out right now yeah. is Can We Just Talk? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had to, you know, really get that into my head because I know, like, backstage, I almost called it something else. <laughs> and, 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 and I had to be told, you yeah. really need to add that just. just. That so. is very important. <laughs> Can we just talk? Yes. Yeah, so yeah. I listened to it oh, wow. on Spotify. It is so beautiful. Oh, it you. is so warm. Thank and, you. I hope everybody else feels that way. <laughs> you, listen, in case you haven't, though, listen to it. No, definitely. Don't have to. But that song, what's the story behind it? Well, um, truthfully, it's not necessarily a personal story. Yeah, it's not like I'm... Um, I went through something like that personally, but I'm someone who actually sits down and thinks a lot, right, about mm. different kind of things, you know. So on this day, I was just thinking about relationships, right, like things that really make lovers turn to strangers in, you know, like imagine someone that you guys live together, right, and you guys can't talk anymore, like for, for a long time, you know, and nothing is happening. So I want you to be able to play my music and think about, oh, can we just have this conversation? Let's talk. Mm -hmm. Because there are a lot of things that, you know, this conversation is going to bring out in relationships and it's really lacking, right? So I feel like, can we just talk? Just brings that out. It helps you, you know, think about having these difficult conversations with whoever it is that you're in love with or you feel like there's still hope somewhere in that relationship. And if there is not, it's still okay, but at least let's have this conversation first. So are you saying you're the generic lover boy type of guy? Well, <laughs> maybe not generic, but I'm a lover. <laughs> you can say that. Yeah. Okay, so um, now I know that there's a lot that goes into making music. Oh, yeah. You know, and, and you've also said that you're a songwriter, so it means you write your songs yeah, yourself. Yeah, I, you, I mean, so it's, it's a whole lot of work. So what's the whole creative process like? Ooh, well, for me, it actually happens like differently sometimes. Yeah, most times I could just sit and the song just comes to me, right? And what I try to do is I try to record it on my phone real quick because okay. sometimes you can have that song in your head and in the next, it lives. yeah, it lives. So I try my best. If I see that man, this is really in my head. I just record it. Some other times I hear a, a nice beat or I just hear a nice riff or a nice piano playing or something then something a melody just comes and i just put like words together and great music comes out <laughs> yeah absolutely i love to hear that so can we just talk yeah now i would have i would have you know done like a line or two yeah. you know but i'm trying not to <laughs> <laughs> i'm trying not to you know put put a little dent in it so I want to hear you sing. Oh my. Okay. I want to hear you sing because I, I need them to hear you sing because okay. I listen to it and I'm like, oh my goodness, okay. where have you been? Know, like, right? why are you I'm here now. I'm here now. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so that was so beautiful. Thank but you. you get to hear his song live from him, Jugo Aces, right after the short break. Don't go anywhere. We'll All be right, right back. <laughs>
Hey there, are you looking to record your videos, do your voiceovers and take your professional pictures? Look no further with our state-of-the-art newsroom, photography, kitchen for our food content creators and exclusive children's studio, we certainly can deliver the best studio experience. Our carefully designed studio space can bring your diverse creative content ideas to life. We aim to consistently serve value to our customers far and wide. Come, let Tharv Media give life to your dreams. Tharv Media, a slice of infotainment. So, mm. let's go. <laughs> drum roll, should I do the drum roll? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, um, so this is um, Can We Just Talk? It's a beautiful song for all of the lovers out there who are looking for a way to, you know, get back to that lovey-dovey turn. Just listen, yeah. It's been a while since we've talked, talked about anything, anything. Oh, and we used to be closer than sweat and skin. It was real. It was real, oh yeah. And now it's different, we can even see just eye to eye. Nice turn cold when I couldn't feel you next to me, no. It's okay if you don't want me, just let me know. But all I'm trying to say is that I need you so bad, can we just talk? Woo! <laughs> Alrighty, that was so oh, good. Yeah, thank you. Oh my god. I really just want to talk after I know, this right? Show. Like we can talk more <laughs> after a show talk. But this yeah. you have such a I know you hear it all the time. Not all the time. All I the want time. to hear it more. Okay. See. But, but Yes. You have such an amazing oh, voice. Thank you. <laughs> you know, and I I I really do love the song oh, and thank you. um I, I wish I could sing like that, but I think I, I take some Maybe classes. Maybe some lessons, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, um. but, but yes, I know that. I know that. Personally, I love Can We Just Talk, but I know you have some other music projects oh, yeah. out there. So oh, yeah. let's hear more about that. Okay, so um, my first single ever was Follow Me Go. That was okay. in 2015. Beautiful song. I mean, I make timeless music, so I don't feel like that song is old. Any day I sing it, people still feel good about it. And I also have good love. Oh, God. You should hear. Have you heard "Good Love"? You should hear "Good I, Love." I, I'm going. I'm going back to your. Oh, page please, on please, just just go listen it's to it. It's on all Spotify of it. as oh, well. Oh yes, it is. Okay. It is. I have "Good Love" out there. I have "Scars" out there. I have "Turn Up" out there. Yeah, and I'm actually working on a project that I'm hoping to drop before Pretty the year soon. ends. Okay. So we'll we'll keep our fingers crossed for that. I love and that. And I have a single dropping in November. Ooh. Yeah, okay. that one. That one is going to be. A song that I, and I, I believe that, I mean, if, you're, if you want to have a wedding, you want that song. You want that song on your wedding playlist. You want Absolutely. that song. Absolutely. Right? You want that song. You want it. You... Trust me. Jugo Ace is right here right now. <laughs> you want that song. You want so it. So definitely. You're going to do a launch and all of that for the yeah, new project? Yeah, yes, I will. I will. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping to do like a, a, a little live concert or something like Something that people can come and feel Jugo Ace is live, you know, with my band and just making great music and here. having great conversations because that's how I like it. Yeah. Nice one, nice one, nice one. Can we just talk still oh, yeah. in all... It's almost like infused in all of your songs. Well, <laughs> we'll keep talking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, all right. So now, Jugo Aces. I know that there are a lot of artists out there, mm -hmm. you know, that you're looking forward to working with. So <laughs> can you, like, mention, like, a few? Oh, my God. See, truth tr 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 be told, right? I'm, I'm someone who is... Um, I'm, a, like, a music geek. Mm. so to speak like so i love great music like whenever i hear good music irrespective of who it comes from like i'm like oh my god that's great you know so there are a lot of artists that are doing great music i mean asha is someone i really love to do some music with Ooh, okay. oh yeah asha you know whiskey <laughs> definitely <laughs> okay you know brian Mo, you know I, trust me there are a lot of them to be honest if i have to actually like if i really have to do it like it's going to be like a long list so a long yeah list. A lot. Okay, so 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 now you've mentioned all these lovely artists that yeah. you you want to work with, and and definitely you have future projects. You already yeah. said you have one coming up yeah. in November. Yeah. But there's something that sticks to me, you know. Okay. 
Jugo Aces. First mm. of all, your name is a killer. Your name oh, is amazing, thank right? Thank you. Yes. Yeah, so I, I want to ask, yeah. when, like your personal brand, when any of your fans or any of us hear Jugo Aces, mm. what one word oh. should come to mind? When I hear your music, when I hear your name, what one word should come to mind? I want you to think about love when you hear my name, right? I mean, love not necessarily in the whole context of relationship, right? I want you to think about love generally as a whole, as a, as a whole like as a human, me to you, right? I love you, not necessarily. Yeah. Just because we are human and we are here together, we just have to love each other. Mm. You know, love is all that really matters in the end. So. Totally, totally. So what are your future plans for the Jugo Aces brand? Well, what should we look forward to? Oh, more music, definitely. Like, I want to make more music, shows, tours around the globe, you know, morph into other things, you know, um, entertainment related. But the music is actually like the major focus. I want the music to go global. I want people around the world to actually love Jugo Aces for Jugo Aces, right? <laughs> Let them know and love Jugo Aces and play my music everywhere. The, 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 one of the things that you know has been out there yeah. so far, first of all, um, the Nigerian entertainment industry is doing so well. Oh, the yeah. creative sector is like, doing so um, well. Like it's, it's a great time to be an entertainer in, this, in Nigeria. Talents out there. I mean, even amazing. the talent lens is still oh, making no. waves. I know, it's but amazing. a lot of talents out there, and you are also, without a doubt, a great talent. Thank you. So, yeah. So, so what makes you a different drop out of the many drops in the ocean? Well, um, you know? I like to be original. I like to do my thing, right? I, don't, I, don't, I'm, I try my best not to be on that bandwagon mentality, right? So whenever I'm, I'm making music, I like to make it as me, you know, how I feel it, you know. I want to I I share my emotion. I want to share my thoughts with people, you know. I want them to be able to feel me. You know, like even when the music stops playing, you can sit back and still think about it and be like, oh, wow, you know, <laughs> that, that really has that. affected my life in a positive way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Really great to know. So where do we get to find all of your amazing music projects? Oh, you can find them everywhere on Spotify on Apple Music on Audio Mac on Boomplay. It's everywhere, actually. You know, so if you follow me on my social media handles, you can keep up. And you see everything that goes Oh, please on. do. Social media handles. Oh, what are Jugo, they? Jugo Aces. Everywhere. Okay. Jugo Aces on Instagram. Jugo Aces on TikTok. Jugo Aces on um, Twitter. Jugo Aces everywhere. Just J-U-G-O-A-C-E-S. That's simple. That's simple. Jugo Aces everywhere on all social media platforms. And definitely check out his songs on Spotify. Oh, yeah. Apple, Apple Music and, and, and the many others that please have been do. mentioned. You were so amazing. You were Thank so you. amazing. And it was nice having this conversation. You're amazing as well. I mean, like, you look beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. And we will have this. Can we just talk? <laughs> After this oh, conversation, yeah. but thank you so much, thank for, you so much for being here. But just a quick one. Okay. What one word of advice would you give to all the upcoming artists as well? You know, trying to push their music out there. Don't relent. Like, it's, it's, it's a difficult journey, right? But understanding that this is just more than music. It's a calling, right? Mm -hmm. You're, you, can, you can make music that can actually literally change generations of lives, right? You could say something in your music that could spark up conversations that people never wanted to have you know you are like a light so don't deem it for any reason just keep pushing regardless of all the stumbling blocks you'll make it so you've heard it live from jugo aces keep pushing keep pushing oh, keep yeah. pushing <laughs> and do well to follow jugo aces on all social media platforms yes and look out for his music and the yeah. one about to drop in november i remain your host natasha this is Stav exclusive bye for now